Pictured here is a forestry prism. This tool is used to estimate the basal area of trees in a forest. Basal area is the area occupied by the trees in a specific area such as a hectare or acre. In this video, we are demonstrating how to use the forestry prism. You want to pick one spot on the ground, ideally in the center of your plot, and move around the prism. Make sure that you are not moving the prism around you. Shown here is a hand-drawn diagram showing what in borderline and out looks like through a forestry prism. As you are moving around your selected point in a forest, you will be counting which trees are in and borderline. In this diagram, you can see the hand-drawn prism, which is green, offsetting the trunk of a tree. Refraction of light through the prism will cause the portion of the tree to appear separated. If a tree is in, you will record a 1 in your count. If a tree is borderline, you will record a 0.5. You will not record any trees which are considered out. In this image, we are showing what in looks like through your forestry prism. In this image, we're showing what out looks like through the forestry prism. This is what borderline looks like through your forestry prism. Now it's time for calculations. First, we need to tally up the ins and borderlines from our count in our selected forest plot. In our case, we had five ins and two borderlines. Please keep in mind that when counting the borderlines in your forest plot, each count is worth 0.5. Once we add up those two counts, we have to determine the factor of our prism. In our case, our prism's factor was 10, and it was using imperial units, in our case, which was feet squared per acre. Your prism will say on it which unit it is using, either imperial or metric. Once we have those two units, again, in our case, 7 and 10, we're going to multiply them together, giving us our final basal area, which in our case is 70 feet squared per acre. That is your final basal area for your selected forest plot. Thanks for watching. Hopefully this video was helpful for you.